morning everyone. I am just uh, sitting here planning out the rest of our meals for this cleanse. Today is day five, Wednesday, day five, and we're doing good. That means we're like halfway there. Uh, we are starting off with our 32 ounces of lemon water and then we'll move on to our celery juice and our heavy metal detox smoothie uh, for breakfast. Have an apple if we're still hungry after that. But I'm just writing down the rest of the meals that we'll have for dinners and everything else that I need to buy for the cleanse. So as you can see, I've got my list here and I'm just listing out what we'll have for lunch and dinner since those we get to choose. And then I have a, a list I started. It's, really small right now. I started on things that I um, need to buy to make sure we are set for the rest of the week. So I'm just literally lounging on the floor in our office, uh, <laughs> looking up stuff on my phone, looking into labels for our microgreen containers. Um, we have the clam plastic clamshells on the way and we need labels and we have labels but i want to get some waterproof ones that way if they get wet um it doesn't ruin the labels so i found some um just gonna get that ordered about to drink my celery juice too what are you up to hey <laughs> uh i was looking at some seeds i got some seed catalogs here from baker creek finally came so been kind of scoping out some seeds for next season and then working on editing some videos and doing some garden research on here. Yeah, we got the farmer's market video. Oh, cool. Ashley's underneath that canopy. <laughs> it collapsed on her. No, it didn't. Just kidding. <laughs> <laughs> cool. Are you ready for your celery juice? Yep. Bring it on. Thank you. Hey everybody. Hi. Say hi. <laughs> hi. <laughs> so we're on day five of the cleanse. Mm -hmm. Now day five, usually that's the day that we start to feel some odd symptoms pop up here and there. Yeah, in the past we felt kind of emotional and and all that. Today I feel I'm like constantly thirsty. I can just tell my body's feeling a little bit not heavy, but I can just tell there's like kind of toxins in it. I didn't sleep soundly either. It's probably part of it. Yeah. Well, we had little Callie wake us up. Mm -hmm. We needed to go to the bathroom at like 3 a.m. So. Yeah, he did. <laughs> <laughs> and then we went to the bathroom too at the same yeah. time. Not at the same time, but when Callie did. We went out. I went outside with <laughs> no, Callie. <you> did. <laughs> so, no. yeah. So day five, pretty pretty good. It's like this is kind of the hump. Once you get past day five, yeah, we're halfway through. We're halfway through, and then day six. You know, I remember day six last time. I think is when I started to feel a lot of my symptoms. So like we'll see. And stuff. We'll see tomorrow if any of those symptoms pop up. We got another order yesterday. We did get another order. Yeah. Yeah, this was in a, a little like mart, like, a market. like grocery store slash mart slash like liquor store. They make sandwiches <laughs> in the actual store. So I went in to, to approach them about putting sprouts microgreens on their sandwiches and he wasn't really he said i like the sandwiches the way they are i don't think i want to add them and i said well i see you got a produce section back there let's let me box them up and you can sell them in the little produce section so i mean we're we're starting to get some orders here on the microgreen side and you know we got market on saturday i went and checked out a market yesterday so you know, I think if we can get into at least two more markets and then sell to all these restaurants and grocery stores, mm -hmm. I think, you know, we'll have enough business to where totally we don't have to worry about doing everything at the the farmer's market anymore. 
So hey, and starts. I think that the starts the start will still be a hit too. Because yeah. I've been I've been putting starts together. So I think I think once I have some more options, it'll get people to come back. Um, but yeah, so I'm drinking my heavy metal smoothie. Ben's about to drink his, and then we'll munch on apples. Uh, lunch is gonna be the liver rescue smoothie today. Munch on apples after that if we're still hungry. And then dinner, we're gonna do the spinach soup with cucumber noodles. Oh, cool. So. Yeah. A classic. It's a, a classic. good one. The it's best. so tasty. The mineral salts in it, just so satisfying. Yeah, it's super good. And I'm gonna put cayenne on mine. And then that will complete the five meals. Meals. And then we can talk about our favorite. Tomorrow we'll talk about the favorite. And our order of favoriteness. Okay. Cool. <laughs> <laughs> All right, you guys. Well, let's let's get at it. Yeah, let's get to our day. All right, everything's looking good. I lightly misted some of the some of the trays, other trays I didn't do anything with. The basil didn't look like it needed to be misted. I misted the red clover, the peas, the sunflower. Some of the peas are ready to go into light, but I have lack of light space. So I gotta figure out, probably put some more lights on this shelf right here, or one of, one of these two shelves, the new ones I just put up. So, might be something I'll be doing today. We'll see how the day unwinds. But everything's looking good. I'm excited I get to see some red clover in about six days. So that will be a new crop for us. So you can tell these are ready to go. So what I do is I, they go from like how it's sitting right now, flat. And then once they grow and they get a little bit taller and push this tray up, then I flip them. So you can see this one's flipped the other way. And when I flip them, that's called blackout mode. So I put them in blackout mode and then that allows these stems here to grow even taller so they're a lot easier for us to cut. So we're getting rid of the couch today? <laughs> I hope so. They're coming to look at it in a half hour so I just took all the stuff that was on it off. Once this is gone, I'm gonna get another two shelves in there. Those shelves are right there. So I hope that they take this couch today. Okay, I've got our lunch smoothies all prepped and I'm gonna go run my errands. So I have mine with a little to-go lid and spoon, or not spoon, <laughs> straw. Ben's has a lid, I'll throw it in the fridge putting some apples out for him to munch on. I'm gonna bring some apples, and then I made us honey lemon waters to drink on throughout the day. Um, but yeah, I'm gonna go run my errands, come back, cause then I have um, some people to meet about other furniture that we're selling. Um, yeah, and I'll come back. the big grocery haul um, to get everything else we need to finish this cleanse off. Um, today's Wednesday. Sunday is the last day. Um, yeah, and it's re what's really key to success is to sit down before the cleanse, write down your grocery list, um, you know, go through the book, write down the meals that you'll be eating. So with the, cause with the advanced cleanse, you get to pick um, your lunch and dinner from certain choices. So if you just kind of like map out, all right, this is what we're gonna have, and then you can go through and create your grocery list. So I find that really helpful. Um, I didn't get everything in one swoop from the grocery store before starting the cleanse because I know that we couldn't fit everything in the fridge. Um, 
with the amount of leafy greens that we go through, I know that I needed to do at least a mid, mid cleanse um, grocery run, especially with all the spinach, cause I'll buy those big boxes of spinach. Um, and just knew we need more leafy greens, so I'd rather it be fresh and make sure it fits in the fridge. <laughs> Got what we needed kind of for that first half. And then second half, then I assess what we needed for the second half. And especially this being our first time doing the cleanse and we hadn't tried the dinner options yet, um, I didn't wanna map those out until I knew which ones we really liked. Um, so for example, there's two that we, well three, but two that we really, really like. So we're gonna um, have those again the second half. Okay, I'm making dinner. I'm making the spinach soup. So I'm gonna show you guys what's in it. And this is a raw meal. It's not heated up. It's raw and it tastes really good. All right, so I've got all the tomatoes and the garlic in the blender. So I have two pints of cherry tomatoes in there because I'm making two servings and I have two garlic cloves. Um, and then I juiced two oranges that I'll pour inside of there. I'm gonna throw in some leaves of basil and then I'll put in a ton of spinach. Oh, and then cucumbers. I'm gonna spiralize these and make cucumber noodles to go with it. I almost forgot the celery again. When I made this for lunch the other day, I forgot to put the celery in it. So I'm doing two sticks of celery, so one stick per serving. So I kept adding more basil and blending it because I just couldn't taste it in there and I like to taste the basil. So that you can kind of add to taste if you wanted. Um, and then decided not to spiralize the cucumbers. Um, ben said he didn't care if they were cut or spiralized and I don't know, I kind of like dipping them. So I just cut them up, did one big cucumber each, cut them up into a bowl to eat on the side with the um, raw soup. And then Ben likes to drink his, so I'm gonna pour his in a big mason jar, and then I could carry either way, but I feel like having it in a bowl tonight, so I'm gonna pour it in a bowl and, and eat it with a spoon. Dinner time! <laughs> What did you do to yours? <laughs> got spice on it? Cayenne. Oh. You're allowed to add cayenne if you want. I put this it out good. on the coffee table if you want some. Your friend wants some too. Callie, did you have the smoothie I left you? <laughs> <laughs> like, I won't even look at you I answer left that. you the smoothie. All right, so we're just drinking our evening tea. Finished mine, yeah. Lemon balm tea we had, and then 16 ounces of lemon water to finish off the cleanse. We really enjoyed our spinach soup for dinner, right? That was the fifth dinner on in the menu. Yep, so we've done it. We've completed five days, and we're now we're over halfway there. <laughs> <laughs> um, yeah, we think we sold that couch. Yeah. Lady's got to figure out a way to transport it. Yeah, and we got rid of the table today too. I sold a ta little side table as well, and then I was supposed to sell some curtains, and this lady never showed up for the third time. So I don't think I can count on that lady buying the curtains, but I doubt it. 
Anyways, we will see you guys tomorrow for our sixth day on the cleanse. And that's it. See ya. See ya. Good night.